to seeing them here and seeing what they can do with this uh, fin step. This is Catherine Copley and Davidas Stagninius. little flicks of the head just adding their own personality into it his arms at that point after the American three remember Petri Coco who invented this dance with Susanna Rackamo was saying that's the hardest part for the man he looks a little ungainly there nice neckline Only a super job. Well, these two last year improved six places in the Europeans from the previous year, which is um, almost unheard of. So they'll be looking for a good result here. Just thought he looked a little round-shouldered in places. Well, Nicky. I think I think part of that is the jacket. Look, when he lifts his arms up there, he's, the shoulders in the jacket and the tailoring so important. And you can see that up round his ears there, and I think that made a difference to the look within the within the performances shoulders look rounded maybe they are a bit because that adds to it but the cut of the jacket should stay down and if you a lot of these the dancers will have a ballroom dance tailor doing these outfits because they they know how to keep that jacket down there might be weights in the bottom of the the tails to hold those down as well so as a lot of stuff goes on there when I had my tails done I had my shirt delivered there was no arms in the shirt because he cut the sleeves off and he stuck them into the jacket so it always looked the right length but I've got this really nice shirt with no arms on it which you wear every Friday night uh, you're giving away all my secrets it's now in fashion I think actually that reminds me I, I owe Ron my tailor I, I owe him I owe him something I'll send it to you in the post when I get home Ron one of the best ballroom dance tailors. The second side of this, I love the relationship they had, the way they're just seeing each other, the idea of doing movements with the, the head just to emphasize certain areas. That's good, that's good. See your partner. You see, she's looking at him and not quite seeing him makes such a difference when the eye contact actually connects. Hmm. Well, while we're waiting for the marks, uh, if you want to get in touch with Nikki and I at all this week, you can send us an email at skating.eurosport at yahoo.com. That's skating.eurosport at yahoo.com. Any questions, anything you want to say, and anything we think is of interest, we uh, may answer on air. Yes. Costume malfunctions, anything. Right. 